Hey guys, today we are leaving for Denver, Colorado. So we are running a qualifier for the big Western Stock Show and Rodeo there in Denver. It's a huge rodeo, but we have to qualify since I'm a rookie. And uh, it's about an eight hour drive today and an eight hour drive tomorrow. So we're doing two days. The boys are eating their breakfast and I still have a few things to put in the horse trailer for them. So let's go load that up and then we will head off to Denver and there are a ton of roads closed due to snow. There was literally a blizzard like yesterday. Today is the day after Christmas and there was a big blizzard there yesterday. So there's a ton of road closed. We're gonna stay in Kansas tonight. So I'm just praying the roads are not too terrible for us because we've never held the horse trailer in the snow. So that's somewhat exciting, I guess. They got these super cute halters for Christmas that have their names on them. So we will probably take these with us. Chester's hook has like 500 halters on it. There's his. Kind of read it. <laughs> I gotta get their hay bags full since it is a really long drive and to make sure they're entertained and don't get ulcers and the horse trailer. some of our supplements or really all the supplements and our medicine bag just in case anything happens. About to help getting 16. Now I gotta grab their blankets because like I said there was a blizzard so I'm sure they're gonna need them. It's always fun trying to stuff these into the tack room because they're huge and puffy, but we make it work. our saddle pads, our saddle, all their food and supplements and boots and their blankets. I forgot to get their nameplate halters. So gotta grab those real quick. need fans anymore <laughs> especially not in the blizzard making sure we have plenty of alfalfa for the five days we are gone with the horses they get in the winter about four flakes a day occasionally so I want to make sure we have plenty of especially when it's colder because eating helps them heat their bodies up so I love their, them to have a lot of forage and we need a lot of forage in the trailer for them while we travel. So again, eight hours today, we're gonna drive, stay in Kansas, and then get up early in the morning and drive all the way to Denver. Never run in Colorado, so it's a new state for me. I think Dakota 
gets the call, we get two guaranteed runs. And then if we make it through that, we'll run in the big Western Stock Show and Rodeo. You wanna go on a blizzard? I do not. Me either. It's on the counter. Are you ready to go in a bit? <laughs> You're from snowy territory a long time ago. That's what. A Mepersol. I know, I'm sorry. shampoo it so it's a little cowboy copper
I guess this one will be the easy one. Probably. Maybe you can pull it out without moving the shavings. They may kind of crash down, but I think. Yeah, there we go. That's good. <laughs> I don't guess we really need to take anything else because we'll fix their feet up here. Yeah. Don't, don't, look like this. don't fall into this hole. Okay. You can bring their uh, blankets back later. Yeah. It's cold in the wind, but yeah. but other than that, it's like inside. It's not terrible. He's got a bite of something in his mouth. <laughs> is not a fan of the donkey. Chester is not a fan of the donkey. Eat that and be happy. You can also eat that and be happy, but you seem happy, so. He I don't think he'll pull this in, do you? Uh, <laughs> yeah, okay. I think the way I'm dressed is so funny. <laughs> I'm ready for the Kansas cold. <laughs> and tomorrow, all of the roads we would have to drive on are closed. So, we gotta go a completely different way. That takes like way longer. So that's cool. Okay, blankets. Don't fall. Very agile. Yep, boots are falling down. <laughs> okay. I feel like I'm dressed like it's way colder than it really is. <laughs> I don't know, it feels pretty cold to me. I feel good. Yeah, my coat's feeling good. Except for my hands. My, my feet are kind of cold, but. Dinner time. Do you think it's fine to open it upside down? I don't know. Enough. I want to get the uh, meds and take them in. It made a heart. I don't oh, know if you can see that. I'm like, Sorry, kitty. I'm like, I cannot open the door. I'll however. shut the door <laughs> and open that one. Are y'all ready for dinner? <laughs> We set it over and drop it, you think? You want to get me a... Is this Dakota's? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well y'all are going to blanket swap for tonight. Sorry if it smells funky. <laughs> it's just Dakota. Not the wrong one. I did. I couldn't tell. They both look good on both of them. Yeah. I don't think he cares. No. It's good that they wear the same size. Yeah. Honestly. <laughs> and everybody at the barn kept telling me. Sadie's got her earmuffs on. I got my rug on. He's got his rug on. <laughs> okay. No more. gets to be green. Need to be green, Cody, bro. Cody. Yeah, he has. Oh, he's a smart boy. Yeah, he is. Forgot to undo it. The shirt doesn't have shavings on. I'm glad you're patient. Yeah, I will. Shavings are. Did I do that the wrong way? Yes. Bruh. <laughs> She did it wrong. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, well, hurry up, girl. Gave you one chance and you messed it up. <laughs> Sorry. You gave her a chance. Sorry. 
There you go, your hair's free. There we go. They've both eaten, they have their blankets on, they're comfy. This morning's actually pretty warm because everything seals. But I still put their blankets on because it's going to be in the 20s. And then we will get up super early to feed them and leave in the morning. So we're all good until then. Good night. Nighty. Good night. Good night. Good morning. Good morning. Wake him up. Yeah. Good morning. It's like six in the morning. We need to feed them and take these blankets off so we can put on their fleece blankets. We're in the trailer. It's like 20 degrees, so it's pretty chilly. But right now we have to grab out their feed pans and take them back to the trailer to get their food. So I'm gonna throw them a little bit of alfalfa so they're not too mad at me. Good morning, Dakota. Good morning, Dakota. Lay down too. Chill. Chester said, I am first round here. Chill. <laughs> Is that good, Bester? We're gonna have to get your pan from the outside. Chester drank good last night. So there, water. Okay, the door opens to the inside. <laughs> Gonna let you know. Mister <laughs> is covered, covered in shavings. His tail's full of shavings, mane's full of shavings, everything. But at least he slept really good. I like for them to sleep really good when we travel. But this corn's really nice. And where are we? What's the town? It's also South place. Haven. Yeah. South Haven, Kansas. South Haven, Kansas. I keep on in the side Mississippi. I'll be back with your bougie rug and some food. <laughs> He's probably more worried about his food than his rug. Yeah. I think. Sorry. Because the blizzard shut down so many roads, we're having to go like three, two hours out of the way. So the haul today is quite a bit longer than anticipated. So we might have to stop and get him out somewhere. We'll just see what happens. Yeah, they're mid for Zell. The coat is first. It's not as bad now. Like the wind's the only. Yeah. Like you ready? Ready to go to Colorado? Yeah. Well, you can't save that for later. We gotta go. You got hay in the trailer. We'll be right back. We're not leaving you. We're not leaving you, sir. He's going. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Chester think he getting left. Cold. Off to get your buddy. It's okay. Go get in the trailer. Like his green blanket. It's pretty. 
feed pans in there and double check that I've got that feed secured. my tack and everything to go in the tack stall while the trailer's still over here. What's in the bag? I can stay for a I'm just gonna wear this. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's everything. Saddle pad, you already got it? Yeah. Okay. I, well, I gotta get the blankets. You got 16? Yeah. That'll have to go in the next one. All right. Weird. My helmet. Tack up and do an opener in it real quick on Dakota to get him stretched out, and I apparently have to hurry, so we're good. <laughs> on Dakota and walked around on his back so I could go in and do the barrels because it was open arena but now that open arena is over I'm gonna take Chester into the warm-up half I'm not taking him into the Coliseum or anything just to walk him around for 10-15 minutes when they've been on the trailer for 15 hours you really don't want to just let them stand right back in a stall so I really like to get them out get them moving it's just really really good for them Chester's not gonna be running here this time but 
I still want to make sure he is comfortable and that he still gets the treatment he needs when he's not running. So I'm just kind of walking around. Dakota has to watch because Dakota is a little buddy sour. So he's standing here watching me. You can see there's some other people in here kind of doing the same thing. I tried to see if Chester would roll, but he didn't want to. Now here's a very controversial video that I did not mean to be controversial. I don't think anyone really was at fault here. It just happens. Um, we were both fine, no contact was made, and if any contact was made, it would have been my face, so the king would have been fine, so everything's okay here, no hard feelings at all. Calm her, brother. I think I might have got that on video. I walked Dakota around for 10 minutes with the timer and then we went in and walked slash trotted the pattern. He's pretty, pretty ready to go. I don't know if those are the actual stakes or not. We'll find out in the morning, but they have both been walked so they're nice and stretched out and ready to go to sleep tonight. It's time for our first run, so we are gonna get him saddled up. I wonder if I need to find somewhere to check in by the, on the other side of the window. Cause we had to go through a blizzard to get here. I feel like even when I brush, little shavings still pop up everywhere. Yeah, there's some on his neck. Oh, you get those fine. off. And then his tail is full of stuff. That's fine. <laughs> They'll shake out, last night so I hope he keeps <laughs> that energy tonight. This arena is a little weird but I don't think it's as weird as the actual Denver. Yeah. The, yeah. the one they say is kind of yeah. catty cornered. Yeah. We are all done until I put the boots on right before we go to warm up. I lied. <laughs> oh they're not bad. Good.
Dakota had a good run earlier, lots to improve, but it was clean and pretty fast. We were only two spots out of kind of automatically qualifying from round one, but we have another run tomorrow, another kind of two more shots at qualifying. I don't know. But now we're gonna make them some mashes to make sure they're staying hydrated and get their electrolytes. Chester's being rude. Exactly. Chester. I'm just gonna do like that much, you think? Yeah, probably. Just enough to get a little water in them. Chester. <laughs> Bad behavior. Okay. And then I'm gonna grab the electrolytes. Chester, you've already eaten dinner. This is a bonus. It's like a. It's a Third it's a dinner. Good. Second dinner. Yeah, it's a second dinner. <laughs> You've been from being the good one that got kicked to the one kicking. <laughs> Need to get me some new powdered electrolyte. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now to get them just a little wet. I'm gonna chase down the water hose. Okay. Actually, the wash rack is free. So I'm gonna cold pose Dakota, but again, Chester a little bit of alfalfa. So quit. Yeah, let's go ahead and. We're we'll getting real, real second dinner in a minute. But be quiet and be happy. I'll just. Come on, bestie. Yeah, you can give them kind more. Kind of soak it up. You can just put like a flake or half a flake each in their bags. Okay, you're getting the watery one. It's all yeah. not dry. It's all wet. Um, give me your worst behavior. This one doesn't have as much. Can you make this back? <laughs> yeah. It's just your bag already. Yeah, I took it down earlier. A little bit more. Yeah. I'm really getting on my nerves. <laughs> In a minute. <laughs> oh, Their blankets on. Up to you. I'm hot. Okay, well then leave so them off. I'm not going to. I know if I'm hot, they're hot. Yeah. Especially since we drove. 
We are getting ready for our second run soon. So I'll start saddling up here shortly. Chester's always grouchy. It's reverse order today, so we are quite a bit later in the draw than we were yesterday. trailer is clean and ready and their hay bags are home. Last night we spent the night in Kansas again and now we are like we're in Oklahoma probably about six hours from home so we've been driving a few hours so we are going to stop at a family friend's place to let them out get their heads down clear their sinuses and just kind of get a break from the moving trailer and here there is a horse that I used to lease several years ago so we are going to go see him too. If he sees a dog outside and he gets, he just loses his mind. Here you go. Hi. Go shut your legs. Snort. <laughs> There's nothing scary. Here we go. We'll end time and let them get their heads down better in a few minutes. Like you left me, go away. Yeah. <laughs> He's so smart, actually. This one he is. Yeah, he is. You were so proud. No, I gave you your treat. You don't need another one. He's like, don't let him take me. <laughs> yeah. Gotta go run some poles with you. <laughs> Sweet baby. 
Look Love how fluffy he is. We'll get this baby a treat. <laughs> He's so skinny. <laughs> yeah. That's the best thing about him. He stayed fat. Didn't yeah. matter what you fed him. Yeah. <laughs> Did she? Yeah, he probably still remembers his tricks. Yeah. Like he just. Yeah. And he bowed. Yeah. yeah. He just hangs out in the pasture now. Yeah. Him and my dad's horse, Bones, they're the oldest two we have. They used to not quite get along, but I guess in their old age. They've they're decided they're going to tolerate each yeah. other. We could always turn him out with anyone. Yeah. yeah. He, was, he was even tolerant of Zorro, so. Yeah, yeah so he's doing really No good. one likes Zorro. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Of course he will. <laughs> or a tree. <laughs> They, I think Chester's about to drink a little. 